Hey, Jake J here, and welcome to Field Notes for Play. It's been quite a while since I played Minecraft. I used to play Minecraft all the time, but when I got a higher performance machine, I moved on to other stuff. So recently I thought, why not try the old Miney Crafty again? So I downloaded it, and I saw this picture on the launcher. And I thought, so I've, I gotta do this, right? I gotta fly around Minecraft world? In part, I thought this would be a cool story for this series. But let's be entirely honest, flying around Minecraft land looks so awesome. So we're gonna go test out these elytra wings. So I started out with a new seed, and I got stuck on an island. That's sad, but, you know, we're just gonna fly anyway, so it's not a big deal. I didn't earn these wings. I cheated. I'm totally fine with that. However, with the wings, I couldn't figure out how to fly, so I thought I probably needed a higher jump. You know, anywhere but on this island. Damn it. So I swam. Having found a higher position to test out these wings, I leapt. And I fell. So I tried again. And I failed again. So I climbed this tree, hoping a higher location would work better. And I apparently mashed on the space button enough this time because it kind of worked. And then the next time it didn't. And then the next time it did. I had no idea what was happening. So naturally, I went to an even bigger cliff because if there's one thing I've learned from the Wright brothers, it's that if you can't fly, then you just need to jump off of a higher cliff. Surprisingly, it actually worked this time, except that I still died in a spectacularly stupid fashion. And for some reason, I woke up in the briny deep next to my island. Annoyed, frustrated, I did what I needed to do. I set up this island for a nice sleepy time, and I took a nice sleepy time. I'll try again tomorrow. Morning came, and I tried out my new skill, and I did this crazy skimming thing on the water. So I did that all the way to my other, admittedly more fatal country, because it was hilarious. I found a tall tree on the side of a cliff, cleared out a safety landing zone below, set up a plank to launch from, because it just seemed appropriate, and I got ready for my first flight of the day, fully expecting to die. I sprinted toward the edge and leapt into the great blue sky, but I flew. So I tried it again, and I flew again. Water landings both times, of course, so I still didn't know how to land, but it was still exciting. Not to mention that watching your character flail at the peak of flight is so funny. I went to sleep, I got in a few more test flights in the morning, and then did something that could have very well been a terrible idea. I got some fireworks. If you know Minecraft and the elytra wings, then you know that the use of fireworks while in flight will propel you farther into the sky. And obviously, once I learned this information, that's all I wanted to do. And now that I was somewhat reasonably okay at flying, or gliding I guess, I knew it was time to really, truly fly. So I watched a 25 second video on how to fly. Satisfied with my incredible level of knowledge, I got myself some fireworks and got back on that plank. I jumped. I glided. Glowed? Glit. Whatever. I did glide. Then I used those damn fireworks and nothing could have been cooler. At which point, it was time. It was time to really explore like I never had before. First, I landed in a village and I plundered their food. Because of course I did. I then climbed up and flew away. Then I found another town and flew headlong into one of their buildings. After a good carrot snack, because what head injury can't be cured by carrots, I climbed their tower and flew to my next destination. A plane with a bunch of alpacas. This was my first time with alpacas. I was so happy, I'm still kinda happy. I wanna go find some more alpacas. In the Minecraft, I clicked on the alpacas and they made a noise. I right clicked on them with a carrot and they made a noise. I tried to ride them using a saddle and they just made a noise. Okay, I decided. Alpacas are boring now. And I flew away. 
By this point, I was getting pretty good at landings. Well, uh, sort of pretty good. Okay, well, it didn't get hurt at least. Plus, I found some horses. After hanging out with the horses for a while. Oh man, I should have fed him a carrot. After hanging out with the horses for a while, I flew off toward a giant mountain. I tried to get onto a floating island, just missed it, and flew into the side of a mountain instead. After admiring the view, I flew off for fairer lands. Once I found fairer lands, better known as the place where pumpkins are, I landed. I then found some mutant sheep and my first ever zombified village. Entering the town, I was certain I could handle anything that I might encounter, and I knew that I needed that tower to launch from to escape from this wretched town. I charged for the opening to the familiar launch point, and I was promptly dispatched by a zombie monk. Again, I was returned to my island. Earlier that day, I had been born on this island with nothing. Now I've returned with nothing, admittedly. Except that now I had the incredible experience of flying through the Minecraftian skies and seeing some pretty cool stuff. I also, now, have the knowledge that these wings exist. And the next time I start Minecraft, I will be hunting for these wings and I will be looking for more amazing exploration times. I gotta check out that water monument. Next time, next time. Not, not now. So at this point, I decided I still needed to do one more thing. I needed to do a nighttime flyover of the land, and I needed to test out the fireworks. Yeah, it was unsuccessful. But it's proof that there's so much cool new stuff in Minecraft, and I'll be revisiting. All right, that'll do it. Thanks for watching. Uh, let me know what you thought. Give me your comments, questions, concerns, suggestions down in the comments section. So next week, I think I'm probably gonna do the same thing. Two field notes for play, but we'll see. Play it by ear. I will very likely be doing two building games next week, just cause I like those and that might be the route that I go. I'm still finding my way. I'm still finding my way. I say that all the time. I'll probably say that at my 3,000th episode, assuming I make it that far. That's me rambling a little bit too long on the outro, and I will talk to you folks soon. Thanks. Bye.